camp today. Hopefully. We'll see. I have to go to work though. It took literally like 30, 25 minutes to check out because uh, there was only one aisle open and there was like an entire family in front of me and they kept butting in and it was like, oh no, no, it's part of the same family, part of the same family. And they had like four carts and they literally bought like a hundred pieces of clothing. And I was like, what the heck is, and I, and I, I was complaining. I was like, please open the second aisle. But everyone's like, no, you know, we don't have, we're understaffed, blah, blah, blah. So I get to work and then of course I lose my name tag. I thought I was gonna work uh, launch bay. Uh, it was turned to Main Street, and that's like the worst shift. What the heck's going on today? And then they uh, honored my early release, so I'm off a, about an hour and a half earlier, which is great because I have a little bit of more time to drive to my spot and uh, set up camp. Hopefully I get there before the sun sets and I can set up my little tent. After thinking about it a lot, more than I probably should have, I decided to pick this place because it's kind of a pie. You can kind of see the whole campground. And I might move over there tomorrow, but we'll see if I like it or not tonight. This is where my friend stayed last time, the big family. There's my Jeep. It's very dark now. Uh, I'm glad I set up the tent. It's not completely 100% done because I need to put the staples in. Not the staples, the uh, stakes in. And there's no moon tonight. The moon just set behind the mountain, so it's gonna be all stars tonight. tomato juice. I'm a little freaked out because under the bench there's like three black widows and I'm not comfortable with that. There's like spiders everywhere. Honestly. So there's a black widow right there. There's a black widow right there. And there's also a black widow kind of in that corner. And there's my tent. Yay! Alright, so this is what it looks like in the morning. I moved my tent away from the tables because I was not about to get no black widow hiding in my stuff. So yeah. I've been wanting to do something for years. Uh, this is bear spray. It's like half full. And uh, I want to take it home and save it because it has a lot of good memories from Yellowstone, but it's full, so it's kind of weird. Um, I was always gonna like go off into the wilderness and spray this just into the bush or something but never did it and now I'm gonna do it boy it's getting hot like it's um it's barely nine o'clock and it's already like feels like it's like 80 degrees already counter assault bear deterrent I think this is the first one I bought it's very very expired so what you do you pull the glow-in-the-dark handle back and there's a little trigger and then you, you point it at something. And then yeah, you, you spray. Hopefully you're downwind. Whoa. Still got kick to it. Look at that. That's amazing. Now it goes back into my face. <coughs> Ooh. A little bit thin. <coughs> Alright, one's so bad. But uh, just a couple coughs, but yeah, just a, just a couple little like vapors got into my throat and it makes you cough. Basically, basically it's cayenne pepper. So it's, uh, it's kind of like if someone's cooking pepper on the stove. It's very, very like, ooh, <coughs> it's a little, 
still in this area a little bit. <coughs> okay, gotta go over here. So I haven't really figured out if I want to um, head over to Universal today or just spend the whole day camping. Um, it's just one of those things. I'm not sure. It's a... Uh, it was really hot this morning and I was thinking, oh man, I don't know if I want to do this the whole day. So I uh, decided, hey, maybe I'll pack up. So I packed up a little bit, but then uh, the clouds started rolling in, started getting a little cooler. And yeah, I don't know. Um, it's about noon right now. Um, Universal's up until nine. I don't know if I want to do the whole parks, like the whole time. I think I can do about six hours by myself. <laughs> Uh, my pass expires, that's why I kind of want to go. So, I'm going to go one time by myself and then one time with Erica, maybe. One last giddy up, one last time. But, uh, yapperino, yapperino. Not sure. It's actually starting at like about 20 minutes ago, it started getting really windy all of a sudden. And it actually feels pretty good. Um, yeah, not sure what I want to do. One of those things.